So I'm uh, changing the cabin filter for my 2014 Ford Fusion SE. So this is a brand new filter that I bought from Canadian Tire. Uh, let me get that for you. So yeah, that's the one. And this is the one that I got out of the cabin. As you can see, it's pretty dirty compared to uh, this one. You can just tell how nasty that is. So I already took the uh, glove box out. This is right here, sitting on my driver's side. And I'll just put this back in. So this side up, I'm just gonna push it in, yeah that went in nice and easy, and then there's this latch, you just push it up, okay that doesn't seem to be working. Might have broken it okay so that went out so now we got one screw here and one screw here that I gotta put in so I'm gonna pause the, the video for a second there you go the screws uh, right there back in both of them so now the next thing to do would be to hook up this connector back onto the back of the glove box there's another one that goes in here i had to take the, this off before i could remove the glove box so hold on okay so i have the glove box in position that's the connector that i was telling you guys about and so this goes in here Let me hard to do with one hand but I'm gonna try anyways there and now I'm just gonna slide the glove box back on right. push it in a little bit okay so this thing's in position so there's one screw here that goes back in there's one more here and let me show you the other two which are underneath the glove box ones right here to the right let's say right there the one here and there's another one to the left kind of behind these two screws so you, you're not taking these off there's another one behind it just right in there i don't know if you guys can see that but right there let me try doing the yeah so maybe now you can see there see it there it should be it should be in there somewhere so there's one that goes in there and then there's another one to the right right next to the door hope you can see both of them so i'll pause the video now Okay, so I got uh, both those screws underneath in, and then these are in there. So now the next step would be to put this uh, trim back on, it goes in here like that. It just snaps in, so, the, so just, these are the clips that go in. So these just snap into those columns. So just line them up like that. And then just push it in. Let's see if opening the door helps. You can just hear those snaps. So that seems to be secure. Everything looks good. So the last step 
is put the spell back on on the right. So that's this right here. So we'll put this back in. And it kind of clips back in there. It's just, it just goes on top like that. Done. And that's how you replace the cabin air filter for a Ford Fusion 2014 SE.